Yo, what's going on guys? Many here and today I'm back with another My Sunday League football experience. You guys are enjoying this so far and hopefully you do continue to keep on enjoying it. And um, yeah, today we've got a really interesting one actually. It's against our supposed rivals, Whitefoot or something. Um, I don't really know too much about it because I've only recently joined. But it's a really interesting one so without further ado, I'm going to stick in the earphones and we're going to get into it. Just quickly, actually before I start the clips, I turned up late for the game because there was a bit of um, time confusion and stuff like that. Um, I wasn't feeling too good that morning as well, but I ended up being linesman for half of the game as my punishment for being late. So from starting the game, I ended up being linesman for half of the game. Let's get into this anyway. Okay, so I actually got my little sister to film this, and she was walking with the camera at this point. But at the back post, a really good header from Sam there, and that made it 1-0 to us. So things were looking up at that moment. Over here, and we have this Daniel Brown lookalike on the ball. What are you going to do with it? Wasn't that just lovely? <laughs> This is the ball played over the top, and look who is that? That is the ultimate linesman, BPL, sign him up. We've just won possession here, and um, Charlie gets his head up, plays the ball forward in towards Danny. Danny puts the keeper off, keeper struggles, and Jordan puts it in at the far post, but the referee gives offside, so that goal was disallowed. But yeah, the game was heating up. Look at this for a crunching tackle in between two players. Um, the ball breaks free there, and once again, we have the amazing linesman in before another great tackle from Joe. Charlie once again gets his head up, plays the ball forward, Danny chases it down, um, beats the defender to the ball, retrieves it, holds onto it well, and plays it into Tommy, who finishes with no mistake. And those two are on good form right now. But listen to this from someone from the side. Then this guy brings it down over here, he plays it back towards his left back who gives possession away, referee with a cheeky dummy, Jack with a great tackle, it plays Danny straight in, throwing on goal which was absolutely ridiculous, he knocks it past the keeper, you know there's only going to be one outcome, he makes it 3-0 to us. The ball then breaks in the midfield area, then Luke decides, you know what, let me touch it down, let me flick it over your head, how do you like that, that's pretty swift from him, and then Tommy with that cheeky little fake header um, <laughs> to go along with it. Then talking of nice bits of control, the ball breaks in the midfield again, it's flicked up in the air and look at this touch from Jordan, Ronaldinho would be proud of that, really nice touch and then play continues on. Danny picks the ball up here, knocks it in towards Tommy, Tommy plays it back towards Danny who chases it down, what happens here though only Danny would know, was he shooting, was he passing, I have absolutely no idea, Charlie absolutely bodies that guy and just shoves into the side. Takes it past this little guy with a bit of skill there and he takes it on but that tackle was nasty. I was landsman at this point and I was like whoa. And now I know what you're thinking here. Danny will he go again? Nah this time it hits the wall but it doesn't matter because he's still on decent form. Then Charlie goes for the whip here and um, the keeper I don't know what he was doing there but he looked like he was struggling there. Little fumble there but he does retrieve it and look at that throw. Tim Howard would be very, very proud of that. The ball is then clipped over the top to their striker, who has a decent touch here, takes it past our goalkeeper, catches him on the way there as well, and um, it is eventually cleared by Jack. But that broke down, and he was looking a frustrating figure, that striker. Then we have the ball over here, it's a good ball forward, played in towards Jordan, their defence doesn't deal with it, he takes it past the keeper, and calmly finishes to make it 4-0. This piece of play was actually sick. Tommy takes it away from the defender. Little like matter, like pass over the top. And it's a nice glancing header over the goalkeeper from Sam to get his second of the game and also make it 5-0. 5-0 in the first half. That is something. Then once again, we get over to the, the frustrated figure that is their striker. He was just, I don't even know what he was doing. He was on one this game, just fuming at everything. He was quite funny to watch as well. And then Tommy with not the greatest of challenges. The referee gives the free kick and the number 11 celebrates as if he scored a goal. <laughs> this guy was really something. Then over here, keeper does well, not backing out of that challenge. They hit back in, he makes a good save there. It's um, scuffed there from um, Luke. It's played back into the box, headed off the line by Leon, and it's smacked against the bar by their player, and that was really unfortunate for them. But we did get away with one there. Over here, off, slightly off your screen, a bit of a high challenge from Tommy on their player. I think he caught him in the side a bit. And um, he went mental, like he went on one, because I think someone might have said, um, get up or something like that and he was like who said get up who said get up he was going on one it all broke out um, it was a bit mad but we're not really going to focus on that it could have been a lot worse but people did do really well to try and defuse it and um, yeah we actually did get back to playing the game and as you can see yours truly is finally on the pitch 
finally made my little appearance there, um, coming down at left mid again. Um, cutting inside here, little one two with Danny. The pass back wasn't the easiest to get to, but um, yeah, the defender just about dealt with it. Up the other end though, they did get one back. The number 11 climbing above our defender and getting the goal. How about this for a touch from Jordan though? Catches it in between his legs, plays it into Danny. Danny plays it in towards Charlie. I was out on the left hand side, but he decided to use me as a decoy to go for the shot. And that sort of fizzed out there. This time though, Charlie does actually manage to find me. Nice little pass in between there. I was about to get, defender went in, slid. And then this is probably my favorite part of this episode. Scoop turn through the legs. Can't really see it properly there, but through the legs, Danny somehow didn't score. Um, I think I'll let him off on that one. Goalkeeper just tips it around the post as I was about to tap it in. So I could have scored there, I was really close. And there is the number two congratulating me because he was a bit embarrassed there. Apologies for that. The corner was dealt with though and uh, yeah. Over this side, Tommy breaking down the right. I was bursting in there. Um, I thought he'd be able to get it to me but just about, I think maybe he might have been fouled there. Um, I'm not too sure. I think I just lost the ball here. Um, went back to retrieve it. This guy tried to flick over my head. Didn't work. I don't know why I used my head there. Not quite sure but I got away from him. Little dummy and the low look pass as I love to do so much. I was loving it this game. Danny takes it across. I was hoping for the pass but he's gone himself and he did get the goal to make it 6-1. Tommy gets the ball in the midfield. Plays it out wide to me. I had a lot of time at this point and um, I just played a little disguise pass to Danny there. He takes it across the defender and wins the penalty. Little theatrical dive there from Danny, I saw that, I saw that, but he wanted to take the responsibility, try and get the hat trick, and um, he stepped up, did he score though, that's the question, this time actually, he's denied by the goalkeeper, and um, it wasn't really his best day, but he still got two goals at least, anyway, the ball's played into me by Connor there, I play it into Tommy, a little fluky pass, it wasn't even intentional, I won't lie to you, um, it's flicked onto me here, and um, I just go for the little disguise pass again, Charlie with the shot, but it's blocked, and um, that fizzled out. Connor once again into my feet. I take it, turn away from the defender. Little nice bit of quick feet there away from the other one. And um, Charlie then takes over, but not much comes of that in the end. Jordan then picks up the ball in an attacking area, plays it forward to me after a decent run for myself. Um, I had the number two turning inside and out again, and another nutmeg for you there, number two. An assist for Charlie, and I'll take that. It was actually a decent performance after coming on, like, maybe for 20, 30 minutes. Keeping on the topic of nutmegs, though, Jordan with a cheeky nutmeg on the number 12. How do you like that? Close your legs, mate. That was actually disgusting. But yeah, that's pretty much it. A really good game. 5-0 at halftime is no joke. The team played really well. I came on and did my little bits. I think I've got two assists, two nutmegs. I'll take that as sort of like two goals for myself. Because that is part of the fun of the game. Just absolutely just embarrassing people. But yeah, hopefully you guys have enjoyed watching this video. Massive shout out to my little sister for filming this. Otherwise, this episode won't be possible without her. But apart from that, hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. Make sure to leave a like on the video if you did enjoy it. And I will talk to you guys in a bit. Peace. That's really well. Anyway, great bit of movement, and as you can see, this movement from myself is very crucial. No, I'm joking. Danny's stepping up to take the free kick, and it's an absolute belter. That goal was so sick. Almost top bins, near enough top bins. Really nice finish from, once again, Danny, who is currently our top scorer. I'll be looking to challenge him.